Good day everyone, my name is Ruta and welcome back to my channel and to more Skyrim. If you're new here, consider liking the video and subscribing, maybe, I would appreciate it a lot. So last time we defeated a dragon priest, what I think is a dragon priest, Zakrisos. We got the sword. We found out something about, what's his name? Gratian Corellius, and he's Gratius's grandfather, I guess, so yeah. I wanted to start the episode in a different place, but I noticed that there is a um, a black book, so I shall read it, I guess. I know I will be uh, teleported into a place without my followers, and I don't really like that. What can I throw away? Sure. I could give it to Serana or Inigo, but... Uh, eh. Let's read the tentacle book. Winds of change. Ah. You know, I've been playing Resident Evil before this and the tentacles. <laughs> Remind me of so, that game. Another okay. seeker at the knowledge into my Okay, I'll go. Cheese. Am Hermes the most painful thing is listening to Hermes Mora speak. Feels like ages just passed this by. Feels like ages just go by while he talks, you know. All knowledge is Let me guess a tentacle. Ah. Perhaps you will be clever enough. His laugh is, is that a laugh that he does that hoo <laughs> thing? If so, you are in peril. Need your book again and escape before Apocrypha claims you forever. Oh, I can escape. Well, at least he's allowing me to escape, I guess. Right? Hello. Wait a second. You know what? While I want to... Raise my uh, two-handed, I feel like it's better for me to fight with a one-handed weapon against these things. Just because my skill is higher, you know? Come on! What the hell? Who the hell is shooting me with spells? Is what I'm wondering. I shouldn't have drank that. Oh, another seeker. Oh gosh. That all I'm hoping. They do usually have good spells. What was the other thing? A scroll. Well, sometimes I think. So I might have to look for that. My light is not working in this place. Okay, let's see. Magica font. Flying pages. Feels like I'm in Harry Potter world. <laughs> that again sentinel what kind of shout do I have wait a second is it not seven no seven is mine can I I can't can I help me Come on. There we go. 
don't know if that thing is draining my stamina or what. But I need to get out of it. Feels like acid is in here, no? Okay, save again. I'm going to save every five seconds. Because I don't feel safe. Oh, I see a black soul gem, which I want. Two-handed. Words and philosophy increases my two-handed. Interesting. I would feel like it would increase my... Speech, maybe? I don't know. Where did it open? Over here, perhaps? Oh, is this a... Chest thing? No. Oh, I... It opens the door. Why did I think it was? It, it looks similar to those things. Ah, a vessel. Elven battle axe of animus. Oh no, don't need you. Now the door to Kebony shield. No. No, I won't take it. I need to sell the junk that I have, so. Completed black book, the winds of change. Oh hell yeah, now I can choose one of the things. Scholar's Insight, let's see. Uh, reading skill books give you an extra skill point. That's actually kind of useful, but I feel like I've read most of the skill books and they don't really do anything for me. Your attacks, shouts, and destruction spells do no damage to your followers. Kind of useful, because I usually accidentally hit uh, Inigo and Saran and whatever. Lover's Insight. Do 10% more damage and get 10% better prices from people of the opposite. You know what? I will do that. I sell junk. A lot of the shopkeepers are male and I'm a female, so that will be useful. Can I go back? Oh, okay. Nice. Um, where's Sarana? Oh. I thought you two were gone for a second. Don't scare me like that. Anything else I might want? No. Okay, everybody, we're getting the hell out of here. All these stairs are not fun. So first, I guess we should go back to Crescius Corellius. Tell him about his grandfather or whatever. And then I don't know, I could help uh, that guard that we met outside the city. Uh, you know. And go deal with. What's his name? I forget. Falk Scarius, right? Fun fact, he was actually in Morrowind in the. What What was the DLC called where you would go to Soul's Time? I don't remember. Is someone there? Reavers, huh? Oh, no, you don't. Why is my light not doing anything? Oh, hell no. Well, I stabbed him. Chitin armor. I actually kind of like it, but... Again, I'm not using light armor, so... Quite honestly, I should craft some dragon bone stuff since I can, but all of my dragon bone dragon bones are in Skyrim, so I would have to go back. Ooh, the Nordic armor set. Mm, I feel like it would fit my character. You know what? Inigo, can you carry some stuff yes, for me? Friend. I would appreciate it a lot. I will bear your burdens gladly. Okay, I did it, and I am going to what ask him next? about the horse when we're outside. I will steal your armor set. Armor boots got the whole set! Nice! And I can improve it in the city, or in the town, I should say. Oh, Tatric shield. Nice.
death brand. Way the oh yeah, I'm gonna keep it. I think it's useless right now, but with that quest, I think I can get pretty good armor. I hear voices. Why is my light not shining properly? I don't know. It's like so dark. Stay on your guard. It seems they've been burning Draugr. Oh! Why did you stop scaring me? Always my love. Okay, this way. Well, it seems they've been killing people as well. High Elf and Imperial. The hell? Well, hopefully there aren't any enemies nearby. Good. And we're back. Ah, oh, so beautiful. Okay, but still, I have to wait, I think. Did I glitch my game? Oh. Hopefully, he will be awake at 8 a.m. I hope so. Okay, he's in his house. Oh, he lives over here. Oh, wait a second. I will aid you if I can. Okay? Lead the way. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to talk to you. Jeez. Uh, sure. Mind if I ask you something? Um. Well. Um. <laughs> following the combat fast. All right. Maybe there's something else I can choose. No, my mind is a sky without birds at the moment. I do know what the hell is with my game. Well, I'll try that off camera, I guess. Interesting how... Maybe I have to ask something else before... The... Anyway, I I'll do I that later. I you're not planning any trouble. What can I do for you, friend? I came back with info. Back. How am I planning Please, trouble? Jeez. Tell me what you found. I'm helping you, old fool. You were right all along. Let me see that. Huh, I knew it. Gratian's death wasn't because of a rock fall. It was just a story to keep people away from the tombs. Now that I have his journal in hand, I can get some closure from the East Empire Company. Make them pay for lying to everyone. Good luck with that. Thank you. Now, I believe I owe you a little more than a debt of gratitude for all that work you did. Here, it's not much. But it's the best an old retired miner can do. Mm, 750 coins, not bad. Mark my words. Where I should improve uh, the blood skull blade, the armor that I got. Let's see, I also. Um, let's see. Where is it? There we go. Take that pickaxe to him. Find my pickaxe yet? I have your ancient Nordic pickaxe. So you finally tracked down old Crescius, eh? Quite a character, isn't he? Tell you what, since you went through all the trouble of finding it for me and all, you keep it. Well, thanks. I guess after all that, why? I just wanted to remind that codger you can't just go around taking things from other people. Now that you've delivered the message, I'm satisfied. Besides, Part of the Thieves that Guild, and he says done that. Me any good in years. Maybe you can put it to good use. Sure. Bring your weapons first, and armor to me. Let me use your grindstone, sir. Oh, I could improve the Stellarum bow. I need a silver ingot. Could improve a lot of stuff actually, I just don't have. 
Okay. I look like I'm up to something in these clothes. Silver and anything from my stand today. Disgusting. I'd rather eat cheese up and sit in the sun. Quicksilver, I need four pieces of quicksilver. And one silver. Do you have that? The name. If you're looking for a smith, you found one of the best. Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. He has one silver ingot. And four quick silver ingots. Okay, and I will sell you some stuff. I put away almost all of the things I had onto Inigo, so... <laughs> you know what I think? There we go. Bring your weapons and armor to me. I'll fix it up right. Not to admit oh, hell I'm yeah. Impressed. Thank you, Sarana, for being impressed with my craftsmanship. For? There we go. Not as good as the Daedric one, but I am going to use it actually. Because why not? Oh, but you know what? That's also not as good. Hmm. Should I? Probably shouldn't. Well, anyway. I'll decide later, I guess. Let's see. Let's do... The March of the Dead. Captain Veleth was alarmed by the strange note I recovered from the ash spawn at the Atias farm. The note mentions Fort Frostmoth, the ruins of an imperial fort located southeast of Ravenrock. According to him, the fort's been abandoned ever since the eruption of Red Mountain. He sent me to Fort Frostmoth to kill the author of the note, General Falk's carriers, before the town falls prey to his threats. It's over... here, so we can just... Go. Yeah, Falk's carriers was a general back in the Morrowind days, you know, in that game. Because I think you do quests for him and stuff like that. I, it's been a while since I played Morrowind and it's DLCs, so... Don't you really remember it as much, but I know that, so... Interesting. too far actually I think I'm gonna want to mark this house on my map Rodolf's house I think that's the the fort so Sarana's here. I will wait one hour for any go. And somebody's attacking me, of course. Come on, everybody, let's just go. Okay. Where's the entrance? I don't know where the entrance is. Where it rust moth discovered. Well, I guess I have to walk around. I feel like I could jump, you know, over one of the things, but I probably shouldn't. Can I use that? Uh. Oh, it does quite a lot of damage actually to him. Take that! I probably missed. 
I really like the sword because of that. You <laughs> shoot beams of energy at enemies. Like, it's awesome. Very unique, I would say. Oh, really? Honestly, I feel like it's already fallen, but... Ooh, wrong shout. Quite honestly, this blade feels faster than the Daedric one. Now I have to go to the main. Quick save, Mage. And enter Fort Frostma. Okay. Where are you, General? Oh no, you don't. I'll take the potions. Um, frost breath? Oh. Ah, I don't like that, do you? What's inside this chest? Nothing too good. Leave my woman alone! Imperial armor. Oh, gold ore. So are they made of ore and soul gems? Is that what the ash spawn are? I didn't mean to do that. I don't want to go into Soul's time. Back into so back outside Soul's time. Why can't I speak today? Uh, this way maybe then. Let's go down. Come on. I'm over here. Take these enemies down in style, like a true Serana, will you stop? A letter to Selena. One, two, and three. Um. My dearest Selena, it's been a difficult day. General Carius ordered us to help the laborers shore up the walls since they are starting to show their age. It was back-breaking work, but without the extra support, those walls wouldn't stand up to a siege. Some of the men are grumbling about the task, but I don't agree with them. The general knows what's best for Fort Frostmoth, and I would follow him to oblivion and back if he asked. There's a supply ship due on Soul's time in a few weeks, and I hope to send you all of these daily letters I've been writing. I hope you enjoy reading them as much as I enjoy writing them. I miss you, Selene, and I can't wait to see you when my time on Soul's time is through. Yours always, Maximian Axius. Yeah... He probably died. Letter number two. My dearest Selena, Euphemius, well that's a name, was killed this morning by one of those awful Uriklings. We were escorting a supply wagon from Fort Frostmoth to Raven Rock when a war party of those bastards ambushed us from the cliffs. We fought them off, but poor Euphemius was impaled by one of their spears. The healers at the fort couldn't do anything for him. And I watched him slip away as I held his hand. I know I don't know how much longer I can stand being here. My loyalty to the Empire and the strong words General Carius delivers to us at each morning muster are the only things keeping me going. The supply ship should arrive tomorrow and I promise to give the Quartermaster my letters so they can finally be sent home. Give my love to the children. Yours always, Maximian Axios. And the third one? My dearest Selena, this is my last letter. I don't know if you'll ever get any of them, but I'll keep them on me in case I'm ever found. Something happened here, Selena. It was horrible. Something's happened at the Red Mountain, but I can't describe it. It's as if hundreds of oblivion gates opened at once, and it's... 
and its summit and its spitting fire and death in all directions. Fort Farsma has been completely destroyed. The walls crumbled like loose dirt and the land is on fire. Everything around me smells of ash and death. I don't know where anyone is. I've been trapped in one of these lower sections of the fort and I don't expect to be rescued anytime soon. I miss you, Celine. I want, I want to hold you and the children in my arms and tell you that everything is going to be fine. But I don't think that will ever happen. Give my love to Syracus and Atia for me. Tell them their father died bravely defending the Empire. So they can hold their heads high when they speak of me one day. And you, my love, when you close your eyes at night, think of me, think of me so my spirit can finally come home. Yours always and forever, Maximian Axios. Should I take it? Is there a quest associated? It's not. His wife's probably dead. I'll take his gold. Hmm, <laughs> I'm a thief, so... Wait a second, what's behind this? supposed to go this way, right? A key? Oh man, I have to use my sword for this. I wanted to use the things that I shoot out of it. Jumping flame spiders. Here we go. Heal up if we can. We may be in for more trouble. sooner than others. Oh, I remember these things. Huh? Oh. Teamwork, right there. A ruby geode, interesting. Oh, okay. Wait. Or am I not supposed to go in here? How can I help you, my friend? Y'all, I know I can move you because I installed the mod. But I just like doing that sometimes. <laughs> oh god. I'm sorry, you two. Let's see, back to you. Prosper. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do it. That is a lie. So wait. Okay. No, oh, this way. Oh no, you don't. <laughs> Teamwork, right there. Just a knapsack, a small one. Can I open? Oh, I can search the coffins actually. A skull. Oh, the key. Ildaris journal. Yeah, no, I will not read it right now. Those letters were too much for me. <laughs> I did not have the strength for that journal. Oh, there's heavy armor variants of the Chitin armor. Oh, I didn't know that. Well, I probably knew that, but I don't remember it. Serana, you're literally resurrecting everything. Okay, can't go through here, so I can go and use the key. Oh, I see him. I see Falx Carriers. I will prepare. Uh, A flame matronach is probably the most useless thing I could have s 
summoned, but that's not the point. <laughs> Stop attacking my woman! Why can't I shout? Oh hell no. Yes, you failed. Okay. The champion schedule. 50% chance for each element of fire, frost and shock to do 25, 25 not, <laughs> points of damage. God. And his armor set, which is heavy armor. A heart, a heart stone, which we can wear. Interesting. Zorana. So, what do you want to talk I about? I want you to carry something. Okay, let's see what you have. She has a lot of stuff actually. I'll give you the cudgel. <laughs> you can use it if you want to, I guess. Ready when you are. Although I feel like I might have to take a trip back to Skyrim to put away some stuff and whatever. You know? Or maybe not. I think I can get a house in um, uh, Souls time, so... We shall see. Okay, let's go back to Captain Veleth. I cannot fast travel. Where are the enemies? I do not see them. All right, let's do this. How the hell am I supposed to? My blade will not reach. I'll just run away. Ooh. Okay, I'm alive. Now let's go back. Okay, we're back. Uh, he's outside, I think. Captain Veloth, wait for me. What news do you bring from Port Frostmoth? You could stop walking for one. I killed General Carius. I had my suspicions that he was undead. How else could he have survived for over 200 years? It's a shame. There are quite a few tales of General Carius' exploits, including the founding of Raven Rock. She'll no longer send Ash Spawn to Raven Rock. Councillor Morvain told me to give this to you if you made it back in one piece. And you got rid of General Carius. Better than a soldier's pay, so you should be thankful. Ooh, five grand. Not bad at all. Um. Did the dialogue glitch again? I'm moving my scroll wheel on the mouse. It's not doing anything. Thank you for your assistance. It's raised my... I'm sorry to bother you. The second Councillor Rano asked me to come find you. He said it's quite urgent. Did he say what it was about? All he wanted me to do is track you down and send you to him. Okay. Look, this is important. Even more important than wiping out the ash spawn. Please, go speak to the second Councillor as soon as possible. Sure. Served cold. Did it activate? Yes. He's over here. Oh, he's outside. Thank you for coming. After everything you've already done for Ravenrock, I hate to ask for more. But I can't risk Councillor Morvane being killed. He's in danger of being killed? How? The Ulan family of House Lalu. A rival great house has placed a death mark on the councillor's head. Why would the Woolens want him dead? It's a private matter. Let's just say they seek revenge for the execution oh. of one of their own, ordered by Councillor Morvane himself. The problem is I don't have any solid proof that anyone from House Lalu is hidden among us. Only my suspicions. Your concern seems justified. Maybe justified, but it certainly isn't appreciated. Councillor Morvain simply feels that I'm being paranoid. I'm afraid that one day I'll awaken and discover him dead. I don't want it to come to that. 
You feel an attack on the counselor is imminent? I do. I've received some information from my sources that there could be elements of Ulan's house, House Lalu, already in Ravenrock. Why haven't you acted on the information? Ravenrock is a small settlement, so it's hard to accomplish anything in secret. If any of them is from House Lalu, I wouldn't be able to make a move without them knowing. How can I help? I had a feeling you'd be willing. Well, if there's listen. gold involved, where do I begin? I need you to start out by being my eyes and ears. Search Raven Rock and see if you can root out these traitors. The best place to start would be Geldis Sadri, over at the Retching Netch Corner Club. If he provides you any leads, check them out before bringing them to my attention. I can't afford to make any mistakes. Okay. Don't worry. You can trust Geldis. He's been with us for a long time. I will do that. Oh, I thought I had my light on. So then, uh, I know this will be a shorter episode than I usually do. Because us last the last episode was an hour long. But anyway, I want to end it right now. I feel like it's a good point. I'm go going to make them a bit shorter, I think. Because I feel like they're a bit too long. I don't know. I want to try it out for a few episodes, maybe. Or we'll see. So I do hope you enjoyed this one. We didn't do much. We killed Fox Carriers. Um, and yeah, that's all, I guess. Explore the Black Book. Plane of Oblivion. I don't know what it's called. So again, I do hope you enjoyed this video. Um, please like and subscribe if you didn't. Follow me on my social media as well. I would appreciate it a lot. I you're playing at, and I shall see you all next time. I hope you have a very great day. Goodbye.